Hello and welcome to the next spotlight video. Today we are featuring one of our favorite cards, Fatal Push, it's a so more good. recent card from so Aether good. Revolt. Yeah, gosh, it's fantastic. If you're on the fence, like, mm, I'm just gonna play Fatal Push, do it. This will change your mind. It's so good. I yes. hope it does. It better. Be neat. Uh, so to go over what Fatal Push is, first and foremost, it is an instant for yep. one black mana. Uh, it says destroy target creature with power. Or, excuse me, with converted mana cost two or less. Yeah, super important. Super important. Uh, it also does have Revolt. Now, if you don't know what Revolt is. Uh, revolt triggers if a permanent has left the battlefield this turn. Yes. So if you flicker something, if you destroy something else, revolt triggers. Mm -hmm. When revolt triggers, you can actually up that number from two to four. So it can destroy target creature with power. F or I say with power every single time. It's okay. With it's converted mana cost, four or less. So you yep. get a little bit more ceiling for it. Uh, super powerful card, super fantastic yep. card, and very, very efficient. Yes, and that's really what this comes down to. So we've talked a few times about Bolt, Lightning Bolt, being played less and less in Modern, and Fatal Push is why. Yes. Um, the reason being is a lot of creatures can outpower Bolt. You think about Tarmogoyf, think about Scavenging Ears, things like Death that. Shadow. Death Shadow. Being a big Especially. one right now. So Fatal Push just says, I don't care about your toughness. You're just going to die. <clears throat> and so things die. Yeah. Uh, favorite Revolt Trigger, by the way, is a Fetch Land. Fetch lands do Super work. Super easy. Yes. Because you, if you're playing modern, you probably got fetch lands. Yep. Really, if you're playing Eternal Formal. Yeah. Um, um, another really good one, uh, Mishra's Bobble. Absolutely. It's fantastic. Absolutely. Um, it's free. There's a lot of really good ways to do mm -hmm. it. Uh, mm -hmm. Repeal your own land. There you go. It's a fun way to do it. Repeal for one and then Fatal Push. There you go. Uh, that's a nice, nice little combo there. There you go. Uh, so there's a lot of ways to enable Revolt. Uh, Although, to be honest, a lot of the creatures you want to hit with it, yeah. it already hits. You, uh, yeah. you already mentioned Death Shadow, things like that. Uh, Scavenging Ooze, Tarmogoyf. Mm -hmm. uh, there's just endless possibilities. Dark Confidant. Dark Confidant uh, Goblin Guide is a really big one yeah. against Red Deck Winds. Swift Spear, all those. Of course. It hits literally uh, all of Red Deck Winds. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it does. The uh, Delver, of course. Delver. The Kings, too. Yeah. Um, so... It takes care of all of them, and exactly to that point, as you mentioned, that's why we're seeing it replace Bolt. Right. Uh, not necessarily replace Path to Exile in Modern or right. Swords to Plowshares in more uh, Legacy and Vintage, mm -hmm. but uh, we do get to see it kind of everywhere. Yeah. Uh, I mean, and I don't think it will ever really replace those. One, because they're in a different color, to different decks sure. to play them. But two, sometimes you just got to give something extra dead. Yes. You know? uh, exiling is yeah. a big upside. Yeah. Uh, and so there are definitely matchups where you're going to want exile versus just destroy. For instance, mm -hmm. dredge. Uh, it doesn't really help to, to kill a blood gas. No, it really you know? does not. <laughs> it really does not. <clears throat> but if you can exile blood gas. Ah, there you that go. That is a different conversation, um, my goodness. And that really speaks to the drawbacks, the limitations of this card. Again, it only destroys, it doesn't exile. That's right. part of it. However, also, it is very uh, restrictive in what it hits. Thankfully, uh, because of the cards that it does hit and the cards that are being played right now, it's actually not that big of a deal. Yeah. However, if you're against something like Eldrazi Tron, Fatal Push really isn't going to do anything. No. Uh, it's not going to help no. you against them. So there are definitely matchups where it's not good. It's just a dead card. Absolutely. Unfortunately, yeah. So, um, but for now, it is prominent. It is strong, and you should play it. I absolutely. Um, Kevin, do you think the benefits outweigh the, the drawbacks? I would say so. Uh, there's no way around it. Um, and I think mm -hmm. the amount of play that we see out of this card speaks to that point. Yep. Uh, it also commands, I believe, an eight dollar price tag right now for an uncommon yeah. from a standard legal set, which is a big deal. Yeah. Um, that is uh, kind of astronomical for a standard card that is at the uncommon level. Yeah, I think it's fair to say. <laughs> um, I'm trying to think of the last time a card from a standard set. Got sure, it. sure. Yeah, to that yeah. point, I, I really can't. Like, I can't think of one. Not off the top of my head. Mm -mm. Collect it comfortably. But it's rare. That's true. Yeah. I mean, you expect mm. rares to be expensive. Uncommons, you expect one or two to maybe hit a dollar, maybe two dollars. But yeah, you don't yeah. expect eight. So this mm -hmm. is truly, truly a powerful removal spell. Yeah. Um, one that we will always see, I think. I don't think there's any question about that. We're um, going to see it around. Shifting metas will change the right, variance right. of how much we see it, I think. Mm -hmm. uh, but there's always going to be a good matchup. Um, yeah, and I think if not main board, then it will sideboards live in the will sideboard. be there. 
Um, if Death Shadow remains a premier deck, which there's no reason it shouldn't, in my opinion. Yeah. I think it's... I, we've kind of picked it apart and we found its bad matchups, but mm -hmm. even its bad matchups, it still has a good Yeah, exactly. To and to that point, Fatal Push is played in Death Shadow. Uh, yep. Uh, and that's yeah. another thing, too. It's it's a controlling card. It's in a controlling color. It's perfect. Yeah. So it's, we're going to see it. Yeah, and super efficient. We talk about efficient removal being premier, super mm -hmm. important all the time. Dismember comes to mind. Yeah, um, Dismember is great. Yeah, I mean... Dismember or uh, or Fatal Push? What do you think? Uh, I think in the current meta, if we're talking modern, mm -hmm. I would probably lean towards Fatal Push and siding Dismember. Okay. Uh, solely because in more matchups, I would find Fatal Push to, I think, be the better card. I'd However, as with Eldrazi Tron, something like that, I would much rather have Fatal, or uh, excuse me, Dismember. Uh, yeah, I it'd think It'd just be right. a lot better. Um, so. Hits all of fish. <laughs> I was just thinking about that. Does hit all of fish. Push gets fish. Uh, hate bears. Even yep. though they become a mana spell yeah times. but, but I even mean, so it's worth it yeah um, so yeah i think yeah. with that being said there's not too much else to to mention about it it's a fantastic card it if is. you don't have them i would suggest picking them up they are technically at the lowest price that they've ever had at that eight dollar mark you probably pick them up for a little bit less than that yeah um so yeah, but that's just the average buy less like. price yeah. yeah uh so pick them up it's a great card do it play it push things fatally the, Fatally the push art everything. Also sweet. Yeah, the art. The 300. Is that. Whoosh. Yeah, the. <laughs> Fun fact never this, saw 300. There's Yeah, you're missing, like, a lot of blood and guts and swords uh -huh. and stuff. I mean, you know. If you like 300, like this video. <laughs> Sponsored. <laughs> Sponsored. All right, guys. So, uh, with that, I hope you enjoyed this card spotlight. Make sure to yeah. tune in every Thursday uh, as we do release these once a week. Uh, if you have any suggestions for a card spotlight video that you would like us to do, make mm -hmm. sure to leave that in the comment section below. And as Will already mentioned, make sure to like this video as well as any others you enjoy from us and subscribe uh, to get notifications about all of them. Yeah, hit that little bell. Do it. They don't tell you that anymore, but hit that little bell. Hit the bell. Ring it, ding. Ring it, ring. All right. Bye. <laughs> <laughs>